Ladies and gentlemen, if you see a grown man shaking a one-ton car like this at uh, 4 a.m., it can only mean one thing. It's time for a one-tank drive. I'm in the light at the end of the tunnel. Paper stacks, yeah, I got them in the bundles. All right, so I've had the Kyger with me for quite some time, thanks to our good friends at Renault. And while most people use this car to go on weekend jaunts and whatnot, well, for obvious reasons, then thought to myself, why not take it cruising on the highway on the other side of the state? Because it seems like a perfectly rational thing to do. This would also give me an opportunity to drive on a road that I've been dying to get my wheels on, which is the Samruddhi Expressway, and also in the process, maybe, Get some yummy food. Finally, I get to stretch the legs of the Kaiga because we are on the Samriddhi Expressway. What a piece of road. What a piece of marvelous engineering. I cannot believe I'm seeing what I'm seeing. It's just dead arrow straight, concrete road, smooth like butter. Oh my God, this, it just made the last couple of hours completely worthwhile. Yo! Talking a little bit more about the Kaigo. Well, it's powered by a 1-litre turbocharged petrol engine that produces 99 bhp and 116 newton meters of torque. And it's not just the power that's impressive, I'm blown away by how smooth and comfortable the ride is overall. The most important tool in its arsenal is different driving modes. I'm currently in normal, so let me just put it into sport <laughs> and it's already responding faster. We have 190 kilometers to go. It's showing me 130 kilometers of range. Alright, I need to make up a 60 kilometer deficit. I am literally out of ideas. I've tried to turn off the AC, I have tried to slow up, have, have tried to slow down, um, I've tried to coast. And I think this is about as efficiently as I can drive. What do you look? 100 kilometers indicated range, 161 kilometers to Nagpur. Okay, um, downhill coasting. I, I don't know if we can do this, guys. I don't think the car is going to make it. Of words. I cannot believe this is happening over here. The Kaiser is an extremely comfortable machine. It's got all the bells and whistles one could possibly ever want, and it dealt with everything our roads threw at it with relative ease. Honestly, at this price point, there isn't much more that you could ask for. And finally, here we are at this massive intersection at the end of that incredible road. And honestly, it, was, it is easily one of the best motoring roads in the world. And to see it in our country, honestly, makes me feel really proud. With that, thank you so much for watching Car and Bike. My name is Glenn. 
see you around. Bye-bye.